<clears throat> hey guys, Moon here. I know I've been gone for 10 days, wow. But I'm back. Hi. <laughs> I'm gonna create a new wolf, wolf maze base. This is a pretty coat. Yeah, yeah, I like that. That's already balanced. And we gotta change her name. It's still a female, but her name is being changed. I'm basing this wolf, even if I did spell her name wrong, I can't tell. I'm basing this wolf off of my friend, Victoria. She, like me, is also a YouTuber, but that's not what's important. Now what would she have this next feature? Tornier. Mmm. What year is torn? I can't give her a look. Yeah, that one. That could work. Or maybe this one. What about her other ear being torn? Would that work? I mean, seriously. Wolf, Victoria, turn faster. I gotta get a better look at that ear. Yeah, I think the torn ear may work for her. But yeah, we got Victoria. Based off my friend from school. And yes, as you can clearly tell, I'm bringing Wolf Quest back to the channel. I may not play as regularly as I used to, but I figured, why not bring it back? It's still a game I quite enjoy, and I think it'll be fun to play every now and again. So... Why don't we see what we can get up to here on Amethyst Mountain? And I gotta say, Amethyst is one of my favorite gems. It's so pretty. It's a lovely purplish color. And Jesus, Victoria's moving fast. I feel like we're moving faster than we would. I mean, yeah, our spring strength were pretty evenly split, but... Jeez, it feels like we're moving rather quickly now. I always go to Grasslands. I might have mentioned this in another of my Wolf Quest videos a while back. I always go to Grasslands because it's easiest for me to see where on earth I'm going. <laughs> and know the landscape pretty well. Because in the other territories, while they're nice and foresty... Yeah, that's a word. Wait, were we just chasing a coyote? Where'd it go? I don't see the scent trail anymore. Oh, there it is. 
You think you can run from me now, do ya? Oh, it was a rabbit. Either way, a nice rabbit ain't bad. Now, won't we try this again? There's already a scent trail, so we won't have to worry about searching that out. Let's see if we can find a dispersal mail. Do -do -do. There's a wolf, that's for sure. Hello! I'm not sure about this. I'm not either, so... Why don't you say hi? Oh, hello there. I do like you. You look nice. You're a beautiful white wolf. The white wood prefer, prefer, not prefer, prefer wolf. Bever. Was a bit of red in their coat? Not blood red, just you know, red. <laughs> yeah, sorry, dude. You look like a nice guy, but. I'm not interested at the moment. Where did the rabbit go? It was around here somewhere. Did the sneaky coyote steal it? I mean, yeah, it's just a little hair, but... Coyotes will be coyotes, I guess. Or maybe it was a raven, I don't know. Never know what time I want to go into next round here. Let's just hope it one doesn't appear literally out of nowhere. And tell you. Here, of course, I'm pretty frightened of the moose. That roam them this mountain. And so the creek. They're pretty intimidating. Especially the bull moose because of their antlers. And that's why I never tried to find and hunt them. Maybe I'll find them and be like, hey, there's a moose, nice. But I'll be like, I'm gonna go hunt an elk or a hare, things. Because the moose, though if a wolf was good enough, they could take one down if they had the pack with them. Moose are quite dangerous. I mean, elk are too. But moose, oh! <laughs> There's a wolf right here! Sorry, dude. <laughs> oh! I think I've run into the one who looks like you. I was just saying I would prefer a gray wolf, but... Oh, you're a pack wolf? Well then... Forget it! Get out of here! You look cool, but... You gotta go! Oh, you're gonna fight back, aren't you? Take that! Not backing down, are ya? Good, cause neither am I! Get going, man! Jeez. This wolf just won't back down! Well, now he is. I'm saying it's a he because I didn't see the gender and I think this looks like a male wolf, so... Yeah, just get going! Bye! Leave now! <laughs> Yeah, I'm really getting into the spirit of a wolf. I mean, the wolf is my spirit animal, so... Yeah. Either way, what can I say? I like wolves. I mean, you would get into character is fun. I don't really do a lot of acting, but I think it is interesting. Get out of here, ravens or crows, wherever the heck you are. Let me get my health back. Because that guy would not back down easily. I mean, good for him. He really is a good fighter, but... You really ought to be careful. Oh. There's already a scent here. Well, I guess I'm gonna follow it. Just walking into wolf territory like I have no care in the world. I mean, I do, but you get it. Oh, hi. 
Hi. Is it you again? I think you might be the same guy. Or maybe a sibling. Well, no matter who you are, you gotta go. I'm not backing down easily, so get going. Leave now. You get the idea. Just go. I'm talking to a video game, aren't I? Yeah, I want to do your ones. I don't care. Just yeah, leave now. I know this is your territory, but I don't back down easily. I mean, I will if I have to. Like, if I'm in mortal danger, like, I'm about to die, I'm like, yeah, I'm getting out of here. But if it's not that big of a deal, I want to just have a bit of a territory skirmish, and it's like, uh, eh, whatever, go. No, something I've seen in this game that wasn't necessarily a problem to me, but I thought was a little weird. Well, sometimes I would see a bear and a coyote, or a cougar and a coyote, or a bear and a cougar sharing a carcass. Which is like, um, that makes no sense. These animals would be fighting each other over the carcass, not sharing it like old buddy buddies. So that, whenever I see that, I'm like, okay! Not necessarily a problem, but okay, I guess. Because, I mean, if it was a pack of coyotes... Wait, I was just chasing something. Where'd it go? It was a coyote. I don't care what gender. Coyotes. Giant sort of, because usually wolves and coyotes. They don't get along the best. But sometimes they can mate and they can have healthy offspring, which results in the red wolf. And it's like, um, I mean, that's cool, but I thought you guys didn't get along. Wait, there was another one. It's hard for me to really hunt hares or kiss coyotes around here because smaller and can wiggle by me but once I do get locked on I don't mind the good chase sorry coyote the territory is up here isn't it? I should know this map better. Yeah, it is. Now, if any of you play Wolf Quest or you're in the Wolf Quest community, you know about Floppy Moose. He resides in Master River. I do find Floppy Moose interesting, I'd say. But also a little intimidating with the way she just flops around. Does kind of freak me out a bit. Oh, this like her. It's just like, um, okay, floppy, you just do your thing. I'll be over here because of my poor eyesight and everything. It's like, I mean, you're cool and all. I don't think you're bad, but. I'd rather be over here where I know it's safe and that I won't get run into. And, and if that was a coyote or a hare, it doesn't matter because there's a wolf over here and I want to encounter them. Now they're darkly colored. Darkly? Is that a word? Oh, you found the black ones! Hello there! I did say one of the red mate, but... Actually, I do like the black wolf. I think we could be a great match. Black and a bit of gray. Yeah. 
I think with my dark brown coat, well not my, but Georgia's dark brown coat, and this one's black and this one's gray coat, it could be. They could have pretty nice looking offspring. It'd obviously be darkly colored. And there I go again, darkly. Is that a word? I feel like it isn't. The more I say it, I'm like, it's not even a word. But, yeah, I think these two will work out. I would take the other guy because the white wolves are pretty. I feel like black wolves and other colors deserve a, the same amount of attention. And what are we going to name this guy? Well, I've been saying black darkly a lot, so <laughs> I think it's something pretty new that would name him darkly. I know it's not really a name. But, come on, I'm in a good mood, and I think this would just be fun. Victoria and Darkly in the Wolf Universe. Yeah. And as I do, every time I find a new mate for my wolves, we out. Ooh, nice howl there, Darkly. I like it. Be the way, guys, I think that's where I'm getting off this episode. If you want to see more Victoria's story, because I know I do, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.